coming out is never easy. You have an idea in your head about who will support you and who won't, but that's little reassurance to the hundreds of possible outcomes that buzz through your head as you try to sleep every night. It's a fear only queer kids know. That growing feeling of dread as you start to slowly accept that this is you, there's no changing it, and come to accept the fact that one way or another, you're going to have to live your life being who you are. Even though half the world and even some of your family and friends are going to hate it when you finally find the one, and the truth is then unavoidable. It's something so many people just don't understand yet. It's a scary journey travelled by so many young people in this day and age, and I just wish people would realise that it's not a choice. It's not a way of life. It's who you are. And no one should be denied the right to be themselves. No one. Here's my favourite uphill gardener. Got time to cut my grass. Come on, baby. How can you deny this? Why can't I be like them? They're all so perfect with their football teams and girlfriends. Why do I have to be the gay one? The outcast. Hello, Brotherington! Assuming that reaction is due to lack of sleep or hypothermia, and we're still on talking nerves, I have good news and good news, so what do you want first? First? And we have liftoff, good to hear your voice. First off, I'm gay! Lesbian, whichever you prefer, really. I guess being gay runs in families. Second news, my wondrous girlfriend has found us somewhere to live, so we can live with her, assuming we pay rent. She's not fussy. She'll give you time to get over the trauma you're clearly experiencing. Now I'll show you where we live when we get back when I get back from college. But here, have some food. Didn't think I'd let you starve, did you? Thanks. Right, I must get disowned by our parents. I'll see you at the college. Bye! Yo, add my man to your class. <laughs> Sorry I got you kicked out by the way dude. You can come live with me for a bit if you need. I'm okay, thanks. Hey, um, by the way, watch out for that Luke kid. He's gotten weirder since yesterday. He's now claiming to be you. Just stay away from him while my boys deal with him. Let's 
good place to hide away from the world, isn't it? What's going on? Why am I you? Why are you me? What's going on? I'm not sure, but I think it has something to do with this. It is! Oh my god, will you stop sneaking up on me today? <laughs> Don't worry, mate, you'll get used to it. How you do, brother? Wait, can you see us as us? Well, no, but your face is more than resemble something along the lines of UK citizens when they realise Trump had been elected president. You know something was her right? Plus, whenever I walk in the room, this one just huffs and you almost emigrated to China. Anywho, you two swap bodies. How about stone? Simple. Not simple. What? It's a rare type of aquamarine. It aids clear communication with all that is. It helps you see the world through someone else's eyes. Hence why you two are stuck like this until you see the pain that each other are in. How do we do that? Well, what I need you to do is face each other and take these stones. Now, when you hold hands with these stones in them, you'll see the most recent cause of hurt in each other's lives. You ready? I am. Yeah, me too. Man, they're being a bit harsh now, aren't they? It's like the side of the The weakest get picked off and the strongest thrive off that. Shouldn't be the strongest help the weakest. I'm just messing with you, man. I have nothing against gays. Hell, I'd get off with a guy who was hard enough. Really? You? <laughs> yes, really. Man, I'd get off with you if you were gay. Prove it. I'm so sorry, mate. I didn't know. I hate to be a cop block, but we don't have much time. Hold hands again! I know a guy who's gay. You should get together. Why haven't you killed yourself yet? I surprised you made it this far! Haha! Big fancy boys! Big fancy boys! Big fancy boys! I don't like you. You don't even look gay. Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve. You don't deserve it. So sorry, mate. Notice anything, boys? I'm me. I hate to break up the high school reunion, but we need to go on a master. I need to get settled for me and the girl Frank go off to Zumba. Nice meeting you, Luke. Well, bye then. What happened? You fell. Fainted. We thought you overdosed. What? Who would even care if I did? Me. Uh, I'd care. And there is nothing that I'm holding back from you. I'm not afraid. I'm not Breath that takes seems easier than before. 
Yeah. 